Big developments today in the criminal case against an Oklahoma attorney. He is charged with helping clients illegally enter the state's medical marijuana industry. News Force Caitlin Ogle just spoke with the state attorney general who just took over the investigation. Caitlin? Well, AG Gittner Drummond says he's making an example out of this case and says those involved in similar crimes need to get out of Oklahoma. He was in a position of authority and power and influence. And, and those are the people that we need to make an example of. Oklahoma Attorney General Gittner Drummond now taking over prosecution in the case of attorney Matt Stacy. He was indicted last year by a multi-county grand jury and charged in Garvin County. Court documents say he helped international criminal organizations supply the black market with marijuana by illegally getting them into the medical marijuana business in Oklahoma. His impact on the state of Oklahoma is remarkable. He needs the full force of the law against him. And his participation has not just been the enabling, but he is actually culpable of the crimes that were committed by his clients. The AG says Stacy has been an advisor to almost 400 illegal grows in the state by paying Oklahomans to sign on as ghost or straw owners. The process is an illegal way to get around a state law that says an Oklahoman must own 75% of a marijuana grow. The other 25% owner can be from out of state. These people are just as guilty as the criminal organizations that are now using those licenses. Drug agents say that's where criminal organizations come in and mask the true ownership, a challenge to prove. They know who they're dealing with, um, and I don't think they care. I think it's about money. Drummond sent this letter to DA Greg Mashburn Tuesday saying his office will take over prosecution, and he has a message to those involved in crimes like this. The time is up. Get out of our state, because this attorney general is going to use his best efforts for the next 203 weeks to set a standard. Stacy, who is still practicing law, is also in the Oklahoma National Guard. He was appointed by the governor to help with the COVID-19 surge plan, and he was once hired by the health department as a private contractor. Now, in a statement, Stacy's attorney says the rules for medical marijuana businesses are not always clear, and when they ask for help, they don't always get a response. He says, quote, we have been and will continue to be transparent in all our interactions with Oklahoma's medical marijuana regulatory agencies. Caitlin, thank you.